Hi, my name's Antonio McLennan. Last name is spelled M-C-C-L-I-N-O-N. Most people throw a T in there. <laughs> but uh, I actually attended Evergreen in 2004 uh, and graduated in 2008. Uh, main areas of study uh, was emphasis in sociology slash criminal justice. Um, had a great experience here uh, doing that. I'm actually an assistant uh, Miss Basketball coach at St. Martin's University, just right up the road. Uh, don't ask me how that happened, but it happened. I actually play basketball here, so I understand the rivalry, but coaching is fun. <laughs> Coach is definitely fun. I live in Lacey now. Uh, very surprised that I'm still out here, especially from Los Angeles, California. Uh, the area that I grew up in, I had no idea Evergreen existed or Olympia. Uh, so it's kind of weird to say that I ended up here, you know, starting a new chapter in my life, but it's a great one. Great start. One of my fondest moments of Evergreen was actually my first year. It was a couple weeks after school started, and um, it was a very interesting one. And I want to share this one just because of what Evergreen has taught me. Uh, I was working an event in the CRC, the College Recreation Center, and uh, a guy, a Caucasian guy, was walking around the gym. I was watching him passing out flyers. And I actually ran to one of the flyers, and I looked at it. And the flyer said, help preserve the white race. So coming from my background, looking at this, <laughs> you can only imagine what I was thinking. He had the nerve to come up to me and hand me one of these flyers. So, I, you know, I, I gave him an opportunity to, to speak about what was on the flyer. Uh, long story short, he ended the conversation with the question, would I had a better life in Africa than I do now? Not sure where he was going with this, but I kindly asked him, out of respect for myself and him, to walk away. And like I said, you can only imagine what was going through my head. Um, you know, I, I sit back and I think about that, that experience a lot, but it actually set up the rest of my experience at Evergreen because it was a huge lesson in between that experience as far as tolerance. You know, a lot of individuals don't get an opportunity to share and express what they feel whether it's a negative experience or positive experience, Evergreen has a place for that. That was a great experience for me, so I, I would like to thank Evergreen for that, for helping me understand what tolerance really meant.